Are you fed up with console spam? Sick of browser messages that tell you problems but not how to fix them? Well, the Issues tab is a new way for Chrome DevTools to help you find and fix problems with your website. Problems detected by the browser are presented in a structured format, separate from the console, and that also means your own console messages don't get drowned out by browser warnings. The Issues tab aggregates different types of problems. It describes problems using clear and simple language, explains how to fix them, and links to affected resources within DevTools, and shows you where to find further guidance. So let's run through that from start to finish. First, you need a page with problems. Well, for this example, we have a page with lots of problems. Open the page in Chrome and then open Chrome DevTools. As you can see, issues were detected. Click the Go to Issues button in the yellow warning bar. You can also select the Issues tab from the More Tools menu, or click on the blue icon at the top of DevTools. Now, you might need to click the Reload Page button since DevTools can't collect requests while it's closed. You'll notice that for the moment, warnings that used to show up in the console still do, as well as in the Issues tab. The initial version of the Issues tab checks for three types of issue. Cookie problems, mixed content, cross-origin embedder policy, that's co-op issues as well. Future versions will support more issue types. So click an item in the Issues tab, and you'll see that each item has four components. A headline describing the issue, a description providing the context and the solution, and an affected resources section that links to the resources within the appropriate DevTools context, such as the network panel, and also links to further guidance. Click on items within affected resources to view details. In this example, there is one cookie and one request. Now, the Issues tab explains problems and tells you how to fix them, but it can also show you resources in the appropriate context within the DevTools themselves. So click on a resource link to view the item in context. In this example, click same site sandbox.glitch.me to show the cookies attached to that request. Scroll to view the item with a problem, in this case, the cookie CK02. Hover over the information icon on the right to see the problem and how to fix it. You can also go the other way. Right click on an item within DevTools to show issues associated with it. We'll be adding more features to the Issues tab in the future. So let us know what you think, how we could improve the Issues tab and what features you'd like to see. You can comment on this video or file bug reports in CRBug, which is the engineering team's bug tracker, or send a tweet to Chrome DevTools. As ever, we really appreciate your feedback. So thanks very much.